Hi guys, postman's bin, two packages, um, that one I'm pretty sure came from eBay, and I think it's Tamiya connectors. This one I think I might have bought on AliExpress, I'm not 100% sure, either AliExpress or Banggood, but I think AliExpress because it's addressed to Grandad is an old man and I don't use Grandad as an old man on eBay but I think I use it on AliExpress don't remember anyway this one says camera bracket and I can feel through there I, I don't think it's a camera bracket I'd be surprised if it is because I don't recall ordering one See that camera bracket? So let's have a look. I think it's plastic gears. I think. Mm -hmm. To our esteemed customer. Thank you. There we are. Right, that's some plastic gears, and I can see straight away they're not what I want. This is for that um, radio control uh, robot wars shunt, and I'm pretty sure those are too small. I thought they were when I ordered them. I think they're 5.5 millimeter diameter and I think the ones I want are 6 but I thought I'd order them anyway because they might be useful for other projects because they were cheap, it was under £2 what have I got? 3, 6, 10 of them they're 9 teeth uh, 2 millimeter dia um, shaft and I think these are 5.5 millimeter diameter measured across the outside of the teeth and I think I need ones that are 6 millimeter, a bit bigger we'll have a look but I'm pretty sure they're the wrong ones uh, so what we've got in this one I think so say Tamiya connectors which is also for the Robot Wars shunt for the batteries Although I've got round it using some other ones. Yep, there we are. So two male, two female. So that was it. Not terribly exciting, but both relating back to that Robot Wars shunt. Just for comparison, here's shunt. This is one of the gears that keeps falling off. It falls off the camera will focus but you can just see there's a split you can see a black line between the top two teeth there so the gear is split which means it doesn't grip on the shaft so that's where it should be it should be just there and it slides off because it's got no grip and according to me I mean, these are only cheap uh, whatever it's called I forgot what it's called now According to me, that is about six millimeter diameter. Depending on how I put it in there, and these do do bend a little bit. But I reckon that's six millimeter diameter. And these new ones, they don't even look like five to be honest. Let's have a look. They're supposed to be 5.5 millimeter. So even with my plastic measurement instrument here. if we're lucky so we're about a millimeter smaller so that's the new wrong sized one on there 
and if I just hold it you can see I can turn the main gear it's just not gripping and I knew I wouldn't but I thought I'd just put it on there to demonstrate so that's the one that should be on there and you can see it's significantly bigger one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> well, that one's ten teeth anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten teeth. So I got the count wrong anyway. How did I do that? Well, I'm happy I'm not completely stupid. This gear here is one that came out of shunt originally. It's one that I tried melting on the sides to seal the split. And this one does have nine teeth. So that's where the confusions come from. So that one is definitely nine teeth, even though it's useless because I tried melting it to fix the split. And that's the one I measured and that's why I ordered a nine tooth pinion gear but it still needs to be the six millimeter diameter not the those appear to be five it said 5.5 .5 on the advert but those are five by my measurement on my cheap plastic micrometer I suppose you could call it yeah Anyway, that's why I got it wrong. The one that I measured did have nine teeth. But that's the one that's just come out of shunt, and that one's got ten teeth, and it's split. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily, so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.